Hi YouTube, it's Lil Pink Sparkle again and today I am going to continue the information that I started with my video on couponing inserts. Um, again, I want to show uh, say a little disclaimer here. There are many, many, many ways of couponing. There really is. It depends on how you learn, what your thought process is, and your preferences and everything. I am doing these videos, number one, because a lot of my friends have requested it, <clears throat> and number two, it is just the way I do it. I went through a lot of hit and misses, a lot of things didn't work for me. Um, I found a lot of information on YouTube. YouTube is amazing. You have great couponers on there. Um, and through a uh, trial and error, I have found somewhat of a rhythm that fits the way I um, can process information and how, what's worked for me. I've been couponing for about two years, and yes, I watched the video, uh, the what is that, um, that show, Extreme Couponing, and that's really what got me into it. Those video, those shows are not realistic. Once you start um, getting to know how to coupon and everything, it's not like a, you're gonna run in there and just get. A lot of coupons have limits on things, and you'll get to learn that. Um, so, but anyway, that actually made me interested and started to coupon. And I didn't have anyone, unfortunately, that I knew that could teach me. So I went ahead and I started researching online, and I came across some amazing websites, many, many websites. And today I want to share with you the staple websites that I use for my information. Um, as I said yesterday, the inserts expire, and the way you get to know at what point do they expire without having to read every single coupon that's in the insert is amazing websites like this one. This is truecouponing.com. Um, these two ladies have all the information you would ever want. I think they also do classes and workshops. They, they're based out of Tampa, if I'm not mistaken. So on this website, I mainly use it for um, insert information. What inserts are going to come out and when they're going to come out. And um, let me go ahead and start navigating this for you here. So um, if you go here to coupons and you see it says newspaper inserts, I hope you can see that clearly. You, you go to expired coupon inserts. And they do all the work for you. When you're ready to binge through your coupon list, it's literally, they start back from October. So I've got a couple of uh, inserts I got to get rid of. I have all the way to October, actually, and I have to get rid of some of them. So you see here it says 1015. Um, if you recall the video I, I recorded yesterday, it you always put a date on your insert stack. This is very very useful especially when you're using websites because they always refer to the date the insert was released or it came out in the paper so when you're talking about a Colgate coupon they'll refer to it by the date that the the insert came out and which insert it is okay here they have it abbreviated I'm not gonna get into the lingo yet I just want to talk about the websites today. I'll do another video talking about the lingo, the abbreviations and what they mean. But for today's sake, if you notice again, October, you get to keep that. Um, they tell you why to keep it. These products right here, I don't even use. So I'm going to go ahead and chuck that whole thing. They're telling you to go ahead and purge all of these inserts. You could go ahead and throw them away or donate them. I know that the, um, the army the air forces uh and well pretty much all the branches of the armed forces they could use old expired inserts at their what do you call that 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 um place where they shop at i can't remember the name of it i don't unfortunately mail them i i know a lot of couponers that do forward their expired coupons to those branches of the military so that they can take advantage of them and again, anything in December, you could just throw out January. And so this is how I keep track of my inserts and when they're expiring. These girls are amazing on keeping up with these. 
They're telling you to keep everything and all the way to May. Tips to keep your coupon file organized. Send your expired coupon to the military and they actually give you the info here and what you have to do to um, contact the people that collect them and um, send your send your inserts out to the military and have them take advantage of them. Another thing I use this website for is for Publix. I shop a lot in Publix. I live in Florida. Um, I used to shop, oh my God, religiously at Walmart. When I learned how to sh coupon, I realized Walmart really wasn't the best price. Um, and Publix was, and I didn't really go shopping in Publix because for my taste, it was a little bit pricey if I'm just going straight off the street just to purchase something. However, thanks to the miracle of couponing, I do nothing but shop at Publix. Um, and this website helps me a lot. If you go and you navigate to this one, you see that they have several stores that they, um, that they give you information on. You have Aldi's. Um, let me see if I could just, yeah, okay, just zoom in a little bit. Aldi's, BJ's, Kroger, I don't have Kroger here, Publix, and uh, Trader Joe's, even Whole Foods and Win Winn-Dixie. Again, I only go to Publix. They release a weekly ad. And again, this is after I bought my coupons. I'm coming to my websites. They have... Um, I'm going to get a little bit into how to shop at Publix again in another video. It's a lot of information. Just want to show you again what I use the websites for. So they give you a breakdown. This this fly, this um, matchup is what it's called. They do the couponing matchup for you. Ladies and gentlemen, you don't have to sit with the flyer of the supermarket and your stack of coupons and figure out what's the best deal. These websites do it for you. They're amazing. Right now on the 21st, which is tomorrow, the new sale starts in, in Publix. And all I have to do is click on that and uh, scroll through their info. And they're letting me know straight off the bat in the orange they're telling me that there's uh, a couple of these items and what the total price is going to be oh man i hope you can see that yeah so the craft shredded and chunky chuck chi chunk cheese sorry dollar 75 each after manufacturer coupon that's what the mq stands for uh, apparently the sweet baby rays is going to be on sale klondike bars uh, meatballs, nature's own buns and rolls, sundown, and they, uh, the sundown vitamins, which are really great to pick up. These are the main items that they're saying, hey, by the way, these are like the best deals. If these are items that you purchase, then it's awesome. All you have to do is continue scrolling down. <clears throat> Publix is known for their BOGO items, their buy one, get one items. And you can use coupons on the item that you get for free. Example, the Alexia potatoes, which are really, really good, and onion rings are going on sale tomorrow, starting tomorrow, BOGO at $3.79. Even without coupons, that's a great deal because you're getting it at 50% off. So you're getting two bags for the price of one. But to sweeten the deal, you have, there's a uh, printable, coupon available one dollar off of one and like I said you could use a coupon on the free item so that would automatically take off two dollars you're using one dollar off of one coupon on each item you're purchasing even the free or the the, the one you're getting for free on the BOGO deal you subtract two two dollars from 379 and would give you a dollar 79 um, roughly 90 cents each a bag of the Alexia um, potatoes. Those are really good. They come seasoned. Just throw them in the oven and they're really, really good. And normally priced $4 and I'm getting them for 90 cents each. Yeah, I'm picking some of them up. Um, and if you keep on scrolling down, they'll, they'll give you the breakdown. Here, this is an example of where you would find the coupon for this item. The smart source that came out March 22nd of this year, that's where you'll find that coupon. And this is how you use these websites. 
I don't mean to go so fast. I'm not doing a tutorial on how to prepare your shopping trip. I'm just showing you how I'm using these websites again. So um, again, truecouponing.com I use for the insert information. I have, <clears throat> they also have a calendar, if I'm not mistaken, somewhere in here um, that tells you, oh, here it is, the 2015 coupon insert schedule. They literally tell you what coupon is coming on, on on what Sunday. This is a PDF file that you would have to just click on. And look at this. So let's look at this for example. In July nine on July nineteenth, let me see if I could zoom into that. If you notice on July nineteenth, there's not going to be any inserts, so I don't have to go and buy my inserts or order my inserts or however way um, you guys would eventually decide to get your inserts. So this is another great tool that I use um, on these on this website. TrueCouponing.com also has an app, a really great app. If you don't want to get on your computer, they're, they're awesome and um, putting all that information on their app also. They have more information on this website, such as, you know, now the summer's coming up, the free dollar movie um, schedules out in local um, movie theaters. I know the one close to me is going to have those dollar movies, which come in handy when you don't know what to do with your kids during the summer. Summer reading program, there's a kids bowl free all summer. I mean, they just have an amazing amount of information on these websites. I... um. I went through a, a lot of different websites until I found the ones that I prefer, that are my favorite. So truecouponing.com is definitely one of my favorite websites. My next website that I use religiously is called iheartpublics.com. This website is awesome. So when I'm ready to go shopping, let me just pull back. So when I'm ready to go shopping on my shopping trips to Publix, I come to this website, I sit down, and I look for my weekly, my Publix weekly deals, my ad. It does the same thing as the truecouponing.com website. However, the reason I like iHeartPublix is because I could go, um, let me just go through the process. So you see, this is the Publix deals that are out. She, this website does the same thing. The Publix ad coupon week of 521 through the 27th, that's the one, the sale that's going to start next week. This is the difference on this website, however. If you scroll down, I'm going to just click on read more because it'll open the whole page up for me. If you notice, they have little boxes on the side here. So now I'm literally just sitting here and picking the item I want to purchase. Oh, yeah, nature's own buns and rolls. <laughs> I'm definitely going to buy that, and I know I have the coupons for it. Um, what else? Um, you know, <laughs> any item that I want to purchase, I want to click on the little box, and I just do my little shopping trip. I scroll down, usually they put the buy one get one items first. The craft salad dressing is on sale, that's always good to grab. The uh, mayonnaise, um, that's craft mayonnaise. A lot of people are very, very particular about their mayonnaise, but if I like craft mayonnaise, then yep, that's the one I'm gonna pick. And if you notice down here, all of this is absolutely every coupon that's out there available for this product. So when I'm done doing my little shopping trip here and clicking on my little boxes, I am going to actually, sorry, let me scroll down. This is a very, very long list. I hope I'm not going too fast. Again, I'm showing you why I use this. Uh, ooh, Crystal Light. I love this Crystal Light powders. They're going to be buy one, get one. And they have coupons. Dollar off a of two. Nice. Okay. So when I'm done with my sh with my trip and I picked, I mean, they have everything from produce, uh, the meat department, which I don't really shop at the my meat for my meat at um, at Publix. So I come down here 
and I press add to new list or if I already had a list I'm just adding more items onto it. I, I press add to save list uh, check all I'm not going to be purchasing each and every one of these items on the list so I won't press this so let's say um, add to save list because I think I have a, an existing list here that takes you to a spreadsheet which is awesome amazing just oh my gosh I love this so if you see this it's a complete spreadsheet now um, you're entering the items you want your coupons and it's making totals for you over here it'll tell you what the item costs what it costs individually what your total cost is if I remove let me remove these items here because I had an existing uh, shopping list that I was going to do and that I actually did a couple weeks ago and so it does the breakdown for you as far as money this is what you wind up paying uh, for whatever item it is that you're purchasing in this case I was getting two Danon uh, Danimal squeezables they were on buy one get one or BOGO I had coupons for it the item was $4.29 for both after coupons it came out to $1.15 each since I was buying two my total was $2.29 229 from 429 that's a really big saving on top of which it's already a bogo deal <clears throat> excuse me uh the hunts ketchup was on sale bogo i didn't need a coupon each item was 94 cents because it is bogo buy one get one in florida it's called a true bogo that means the one item would ring up the next item would ring up and then they automatically deduct the price but if you do the math, you divide it in two, this is what it would be. Those two bo um, bottles of ketchup. And so you see, it breaks everything down. And at the end, I'll see what I'm going to be paying. This would have been my price before coupons. Let me zoom into that. This would have been my price before coupons. This is the total amount of coupons that would be deducted. This is my uh, price after coupons. If you notice, not the best deal, but there's a lot of items here that I wasn't getting. I didn't have coupons for, but in my opinion, according to the way I shop, it was still a good deal. And that's something that you'll learn also. So uh, just to recap, iHeartPublix is this website, an amazing website if you shop at Publix. The next website I'm going to take you to is called thecrazycouponlady.com. This is actually the first website I ever went to when I first started. I wanted to learn how to coupon. These women are amazing. And um, this website is really, really great for beginners. It does look overwhelming because it has so much information on it. But what I would like for you to do, I'm assuming that everyone that's watching this video, it, you know, you guys are starting out or just learning how to. So the place I would send you here is the tab that's called tips. And the first thing I would start reading is this right here. It's called 10 days to become a crazy coupon lady. And they literally walk you through each step, why you should coupon, why it's better to shop in this way, Day one, change the way you shop. Number one rule, um, there's a whole strategic way of shopping when you decide to coupon. You just don't roll up into the store with your coupons. And this 10-day tutorial was amazing for me. Um, I, I really, really went step by step. I remember my first shopping trip was to CVS and it was just for one item. And then I waited the next week and then I went in for two items and I learned little by little. I first wanted to learn how to coupon because I wanted to save on shampoos and deodorant and hair products and, you know, um, laundry detergent and things like that. And I started, I chose to start with CVS. But the Crazy Coupon Lady website was amazing and getting to, to have me start thinking differently about shopping. I suggest you guys definitely give this um, a look at and, um, and I think you're going to learn a lot from it. 
Another thing I come to the Crazy Coupon Lady for, if you go here to stores, oh my gosh, there's every single store that you could imagine on their website. The breakdowns are for each and every one of these stores, they have it. Um, for example, I don't have Rite Aid in my uh, area, but they have a breakdown for Rite Aid, Trader Joe's, Safeway, Kroger's, um, Harris Teeter. I mean, these are stores that I don't have, but they got you covered if, you know, if these stores are around you. So I went to CVS and they do exactly the same thing that all the other websites do. They give you the latest CVS sale. That's uh, the, the one that started Sunday because C CVS's deals start from Sunday to Saturday. And then they give you breakdowns like crazy that tell you what to do, how to buy it, what, you know, what coupons to use, what your, you know, out of pocket is going to be in CVS. They have extra care bucks. Which ones will you be receiving back? All of this. Again, most of the work is done for you. I usually copy and paste the information on a, on a separate piece of paper and take that with me when I go shopping. So Crazy Coupon Lady is amazing for the beginner's info, CVS deal. I use it for Dollar Tree also. If you didn't know, the Dollar Tree takes coupons um, and a lot more info. So Crazy Coupon Lady, definitely a great website to use. Um, my next one, I'm going to try to move a little bit quickly here. Hip, hip to Save. She's awesome. She even does videos. This is another really great. And if you look at it, pretty much all these websites have the same information they they come up with the same information it's just a matter of what which website you like i switch back and forth but i have a rhythm to my madness you know i know what to check for and who to back up the information with who's posted their info quicker than others you know and stuff like that so hip to save also has an app i have on my phone I've gotten everything from CVS breakdowns and CVS shopping trips to free magazine subscriptions. I can't even tell you. I have uh, Cosmo, uh, Home and Gardens, the Lego uh, magazines for my son, um, Fitness, Weight Watchers. All of these magazines I receive absolutely for free and it's thanks to hip to save She lets you know, hey, by the way, these people are offering free subscriptions. And usually it just takes you to go to the website link that she provides and just filling out basic information. Sometimes you just got to do a little questionnaire kind of thing. And if you scroll down her page, um, apparently Highline Coffee, you get a free tote bag with any coffee purchase. I don't know what Highline Coffee is, but I think that's cool. All Recipes Magazine subscription. There you go. This one is uh, uh, $4.99 for the whole year. If you're into this magazine or you're interested, $4.99 for a year subscription magazine, that's pretty pretty good. Um, Old Navy is having a 50% off swimwear for the entire family in store, plus 50% off online, additionally 20% off. If I don't go to these stores normally, I wouldn't know. And her app, when I have it on my phone, it gives me that alert. And if I'm interested in getting swimwear at Old Navy, then I'm definitely going over there. So if you see a lot of, she deals with Amazon, Walmart, a lot of online deals. If you like online shopping, needless to say, it is just a crazy amount of information on here. Um, I use her again. Target. She is a Target queen. If you notice on this side right here, these are the stores she shops. Uh, she gives breaks down, breakdowns for Amazon, CVS, Rite Aid, Target, Walgreens, and Walmart. Her Target shopping <laughs> trips are insane. I can't even tell you how many great toys I got for Christmas. Super low prices because of her. Um, she does videos also. She's on YouTube. Um, the crazy coupon lady. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's hip to save. If you just search her on YouTube, you could see the the videos, which in my opinion worked really well for me because I'm a very visual person. So to have to see her actually go to the store and do the shopping trip on, you know, on the screen and everything and take you step by step really, really helped me out. 
in a lot of cases when I was just learning how to do it. So, um, yeah, so hip to save target CVS and the app info. Amazing. Among all the other information that's on the website. And last but not least, I just came across this website and I learned I, um, on Facebook about them. They're called Welcome to Publix Couponing 101. Now, I know you're saying, well, geez, if you already use iHeart Publix, this page, they tend to put out the super undercover deals that I would have never gotten on iHeart Publix because she just does the breakdown for the weekly sale. This website is really awesome too. And uh, like I said, I, I subscribe to them on Facebook and that's how I found out about them. And they do, they do a great job in telling you what the rock bottom sale is, um, not only with the weekly sale for Publix, but the, they have Advantage Flyers. And for example, right here, everyone buy two, apparently the Huggy diapers or the pull-ups are on sale. They're automatically, let me see. The pull-ups are on sale. They have a Publix coupon in the Beauty Advantage flyer. That oh, the sale starts on the 23rd. So if you notice this, he's already putting up sales that are gonna start Saturday. So he's giving you a super, or she is giving you a super heads up for this Saturday. If you're in the market for Huggies diaper, uh, there's gonna be a coupon that you can use, and there's another printable coupon making these diapers $7.98 for two or $3.99 each a pack. Listen, I don't know about you. I remember buying diapers. They're super expensive. And you, if you could get them down to $3.99 a pack for uh, 18 to 156 count of Huggies diapers, that's a really, really great deal. If you go down like this, I like that he puts pictures these are the inserts and the coupons that we should be expecting this week. This is a lot of work, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, I'm so thankful to these websites. Super cheap go-to hair styling products, two-day only. So now he's giving you a heads up. This coupon is going to expire soon. The sale starts Saturday also for these uh, got-to-be hair styling products if you're a really fan of that you could get it as cheap as a dollar 24 each and the original price on these items if you look he takes pictures it's uh 4.99 so yeah it's definitely um a, an awesome website the the smuckers topping for ice cream i'm not really into that but hey you have a Sunday party coming up. There's going to be a really good sales on that. And as you see, you know, reminder, Pert Shampoo Conditioner as low as 60 cents, 66 cents. 66 cents on a bottle of shampoo at Publix. Don't tell me Publix is too expensive to shop at. It's just, you know, they have amazing deals. You just have to know and use your coupons and use their sales. So... This website is also really, really great. And like I said, he's giving me info that iHeartPublix doesn't even have out. But I know to look for him, you know, for those sneak peek um, deals. I have been talking so much and I'm so sorry, but I really wanted to get this video out. I am going to do another video specifically on public shopping because that's where I do my shopping. Um... And I'm going to do the breakdown and show you exactly what I'm going to go shopping for. I don't mean to sound so rushed through the for the information. Um, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. I'll be more than happy to answer it. I know couponing could get very complicated and, and overwhelming. But um, if you at least... At the very, very minimum, I suggest you buy your paper on Sunday and just take a look at one of these websites. Just one. Just pick one and um, and just browse through it. Get familiar with it. And uh, and I, said, I think it'll help. I, and it won't make it as scary as everyone thinks couponing is. So again, to recap, it's truecouponing.com iHeartPublix.com, 
the crazy coupon lady.com hip to save that's with the number two dot com my Publix couponing 101.com I will link each and every one of these websites below until the next video thank you so much for watching thank you for subscribing and please share a little your sparkle with everyone you meet bye